You should have your calculator down and you should be paying attention. Isaiah, help him out. Good. So I would do circumference equals pi times 
diameter, which Isaiah told us is what, Darren? Twelve. Go ahead and do that on your calculator. Raise your hand when you get the correct answer. When you get an answer, you think it's correct. Do it on your calculator. Pi. Pi can also be known as 3.14 times our diameter, and we get what? I said raise your hand when you get what you think is the correct answer. Raise your hand. Remind me of your name again? Kishan. Kishan, what did you get? 37.69. Very good. So the circumference is 37.69. Six eighths. It depends on if you do pi like this, you're going to get a different answer than if you just do 3.14. So it's within the range. So then area, what do I plug in for area? Erica, using area equals pi times radius squared, what would I plug in for, for area to find the area? What do we know? Tell us. Pi times what? What's our radius? Six squared. So we're going to do pi times six squared. Six squared is the same as six times what? Six times six. Go ahead and do that. Let me see. Repeat. 
repeat after me. Area. Area. Apple. 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 Area. Area. Apple. Apple. Pie. Pie. Pies. Pie. Pie. Pies. J. Radius. R. 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 Squared. Squared. Two. Two. Squared. Squared. Two. Area equals. Area equals. Area equals. Pie times radius squared. Pie times radius squared. Apple pies. Apple R two. R two. Apple pies. Apple pie. R two. R two. Okay. So this is what we're going to be working on. So what I need. Listen very carefully here. What I need is I need. I'm going to give you 30 seconds. You need to take your pizza. Don't start until I say go. Take your pizza, put it back in your plastic bag, and then get out your homework and be ready to go over it in 15. Go. 15. 